And joining us live in the studio to talk about uh, uh, pet recycling is um, Michael Ajayi, who is the country director for Enactus Nigeria. Good to have you. Nice to have you too. And of course, Adeolu Adegboye, who is the team lead for Covenant University. Congratulations, you guys emerged the champions for 2019. Thank you so much. Now, good to have you both. So let's begin with uh, you, Mr. Ajayi. Uh, let's, let's understand how is Enactus involved in all of this PET uh, project? Great. So Enactus is an international non-profit organization with uh, um, activities in 37 countries around the world, in 10 African countries, and Nigeria being one of the 10. Mm. So uh, Enactus is focused on creating a better world through the power of entrepreneurship. Right. So we believe that it is, the, it is the development of leadership skills and entrepreneurial skills amongst young people that can actually help create a better world, mm -hmm. a sustainable world, a world that equity is guaranteed around, uh, across sectors. So in Nigeria, an actor has been present since 2000. Indeed, this year becomes our 20th year anniversary, mm -hmm. and later in the year, we'll be having a big celebration Great. to celebrate the impact we've made, to celebrate the successes we've recorded, Mm -hmm. and to make a new plan for the next 20 years. Mm -hmm. uh, like I said, we are focused on developing the leadership and entrepreneurial skills of young people. For us in Nigeria, we are also looking at transitioning or transforming students from regular students into high-performing, deliberate, purposeful, and values-driven social innovators. Mm -hmm. And what you see through this, uh, the Pet City Project is a classic example of uh, the journey that we take them through. Indeed, the students are already demonstrating uh, characteristics of becoming social entrepreneurs. Right. Now, at uh, the end of the year, mm -hmm. they come up, they uh, have what we call, we have what we call the national competition where they showcase, all the teams in Nigeria showcase what they have done and the impact they have re made across the country. It is during that event last year that we saw several innovations, including the Pet City, and as God will have it, the Pet City emerged the national champion. Last yeah, time. Okay, so and we're privileged to have you, Adeolu, here, who's representing the team from Covenant University. At what point did it become apparent to you that you want to intervene in terms of recycling uh, pet bottles and making it a business venture, so to speak? Okay, I think the moment that sparked us into taking action was when we were carrying out needs assessments in the various communities and environments. And we noticed that most of them were becoming susceptible to flood and mm -hmm. the disasters that came with it. And then on looking at the root cause of these problems, it was they had blocked drainages. But not only that these drainages were blocked, they were blocked by plastics because they were improperly disposed. So looking further, we wanted to take out a problem, but we had to realize that the people factor was still eminent, which was the mentality people had towards plastic disposals. Most people don't value it has a big problem. They see it as just dropping it off in the environment, not realizing that these plastics stay up in the environment for up to a thousand years, mm -hmm. if not disposed. Mm -hmm. And since they are synthetic polymers, we can recycle them, melt them, and reconvert them into interlocking bricks. Okay. So for us, we saw that as a very big opportunity mm -hmm. to capitalize on that problem and flourish from there. So what the way our team is structured, we have different project groups, mm -hmm. but on recruitment, Enactus has its worldwide standards on how you recruit members in, orientate them on the processes of value creation and basically problem finding and project management in the NACTA standard way. Mm -hmm. So on getting them drilled in that process, we then split the group into different project groups and then Pet City was actually just one project group until we merged such a profit, such a promising project. Mm -hmm. So we centered most of our attention and energy on that. On it. All right, let me go to you, Mr. Ajayi. Um, why, of all the projects, I'm, I'm sure you saw so many of them, why did Pet City, I believe that's the name of your project, yes, why did Pet City emerge? What was outstanding about Pet City? One thing that is consistent amongst an actor's projects is innovation. Right. So every year we see a ton of innovations coming out and it's always mind-blowing, right? Um, but one of the things I think stood out for this was its relevance. Mm. It is 
time, the, the entire world is talking about environmental sustainability. Indeed, one of, one of the SDGs speaks to that. That's right. And so it's relevant. It's not just a local problem. Indeed, it is a local problem, mm -hmm. but it has a global implication yeah, as well. Correct. And so that makes it very relevant. Lastly, how does it feel to represent Nigeria um, when you went for the championship? the championship? Well, it was a surreal experience, I can't <laughs> lie. I mean, meeting with various people all across the world, it showed you that in one way or the other, we are still all interrelated. Mm -hmm. And even showing off the Nigerian culture, it, it gave them a, a sense, it gave us a sense of pride. Mm -hmm. And other people all around the world are always excited to see Africans coming out in their own shapes and forms and mm. sizes. Thank you so very much, Ade Olu, Thank for you. representing us and for making impact. And of course, to you, Mr. Ajayi, and your organization for pushing uh, to get more young people, you know, give them the best opportunity there are. Thank you.